Secretary. A lot of people come here only to eat soil. And you can see them eating soya on Sunday. The place is full. And they come, they eat the soya in the drink. It's fresh cow, freshly slaughtered and um, hot so at least you know that what you are eating is germ free today is um, Saturday I think the 12th so I'll be leaving on Sunday and uh, taking my way back to the U.S. What is here? Mm. The same Parisian. As I was saying, this guy is eating. You see that? I've driving and eating too. I've done some. I don't know, this is See, this is where people come and buy shampoo. The people are dead by shampoo. So I call them Cameroon shampoo people. Chacolians. What do people use coal for? Hmm? You need the chacol. Then fish. Then corn. Roast, roast corn. Roast meat. Yeah. Like this one, right? Oh, this is firewood. So, Kitty family. You came to stop them and several police. They were doing control. So they asked my driver to clear. And one of the police came over to my driver and asked him to give documents of the car. Now this guy was just trying to either see the car or who was in the, in the car. So I asked him first why we will be asking document of the car. Then he, he told me that he was asking, but he was asking the driver, not me. So I decided to give him. Two of the, three of the soil that I was eating. See, this is one soil. 
Then, I know he's been standing there, he's hungry, so I gave him three of my soil. and told my driver to go without looking at the books. So, they pull, they, they have a lot of pineapples on, on the truck, so they push it. The pineapples are already, you see the police over there, lousy police. Sometimes they, they create more problems than solve. So, as I was saying, the, uh, this dude, that they slice the pineapple, they pull it, and they slice coconut, they pull it. They're pulling the, the trucks, they're going to the streets and they're selling them, like what you see with the melon there. He's handling with his hands. So when they get someplace, they feel like urinating. They go, they just go by the roadside and hold their dick and pee. Then they come back, start pushing their truck. I, need, I like to see one of the dudes I show you. And don't know where person come from. The guy takes one and gives and takes the 50 francs and pockets it and start going. You know what? The guy didn't wash his hands after being. The guy held his dick when he was being. And this person doesn't know what he's eating. Eating the pineapple plus beef plus all kinds of bacteria. See, that is how some of the diseases are passed from people to people here. Meanwhile, you could have bought a whole pineapple, you go home, you wash it, and then you clean it. Right? Meanwhile, you could have bought a whole coconut. You go home, you crack it, you wash it, then you crack it, and you peel it up and you eat it. So, somehow you need a functional public health system here to educate people about hygiene to educate people about flushing their teeth not using a stick from soya scraping the patches of meat and eating them back it's like somebody picking his nose it's like somebody picking his nose and eating the burgers right until next time when I visit this poor country <laughs> poor country in that some people make it so big and some people can't make it they are at the bottom of the poor river you get me they can barely make ends meet these are the people who buy the pineapple from that guy who just touched his foot and dick. You get me? Somebody keeps calling this dude. Doesn't know where to give up. And you hear like this. There's somebody who cannot stay on the line. He wants this dude to call him back. It's called beeping here in Cameroon. You don't have you don't want to spend your money on airtime. You call and the person will pick up and you'll be wondering who is calling and why. 
they will call you back. That's how they do it here. You see all the kinds of cars that they have here. You have a car today. Oh, you see those cars? These are motorbikes. Some of those people are nasty. They're dirty, they don't wash, they smell. You climb like this one, you see? Three people on top. And if they have lice, you probably pick up lice, right? They get up in the morning, they don't take a shower. They put, they have their, they have some clothes, which is called work clothes. They take it and they put it on. Don't wash it for two weeks. Don't wash it for one week. That's all. He has a motorbike, so he says, yeah. Because that's what he used to do. Let me point him to you guys. See him? It's one of them. He doesn't wash. And then you'll be like smelling, and then some people will come out of the bag and say, huh, try wash it. People love it. <laughs> right? People love it too. <laughs> it's a sound you see. Look at them. So they, they take two, 200. You see this one? Yeah. They take two, 200. Two, 200. By evening, they have money to feed their family. They have money to pay their rents. You wanna go look for the flush or uh, the pharmacy box? Don't go inside. Huh? No. Il n'y a pas. 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 Il n'y a pas.